Two valuable animals disappear from a local museum exhibit, but they don't get very far. The taxidermy animals were stolen early this morning, then found a few blocks away. Eyewitness News reporter Carol Ferguson has a story. Carol? The accused thief was found along with one animal sitting outside a restaurant. Police say he was drinking a cup of coffee. In jail this afternoon, he says the idea to take the animal simply popped into his head. At the museum, they call this a serious loss. Stolen for a while, an Australian dingo and an African leopard from the Buena Vista Museum of Natural History right on Chester Avenue. I hear voices, you know, I, I hear my old commander. Henry Slivers is already in jail accused of the crimes. He told me first he got the idea to steal the leopard and took it back to his hotel room. He's lived here for a couple months. The leopard was found here a couple hours later. Then he says he got the idea to go back and steal the dingo. He went a couple blocks to the restaurant, was spotted here with the taxidermy dingo, and quickly arrested. Our whole goal here is to educate the community. Museum director Coral Hantrick says thousands of kids come here every year. The damage is a setback to the goal of helping kids learn. Well, I have no idea about that. Slivers couldn't take that in, but the museum says the two animals need repairs. And of course, the big plate glass window has to be replaced, and that's expensive. It's really important for the museum to continue to be here for the uh, public and for the community. Um, but something like this really gives us a setback because it's an, it's an unexpected expense. Now, police tell me the two taxidermy animals are worth several thousand dollars each. And I asked about the charges Slivers could face. I'm told he was arrested on burglary and possession of stolen property. Those are felony charges, and he could face prison time. Back to you.